it would depend on the nature of the settlement. It would depend on what you exactly settled. Uh, normally, if you settled with your own insurance company, you're going to sign some sort of a release or something bringing the case to an end. But I don't think that your insurance company normally would be getting you to sign a release that would preclude a suit against some other entity. But it, it, it would be an odd situation to have already settled with your insurance carrier and then still want to pursue a, a claim against the manufacturer. I'm not saying that those things couldn't happen because obviously if you have a situation involving many parties with competing interests, some of those parties may want to settle with you at different times and on different terms than others. So there could be, I guess, a situation where your insurance company would pay for something and you would try to sell it, but that would be a unique situation because normally it would be the other way around. You would settle with defendants or other parties and then be looking at your own insurance company for something like uninsured motorist or something like that, in which case you would have had to resolve something with the defendants first. Um, so uh, I guess theoretically you could do that, but it would be an unusual situation. <laughs>